Slow, 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 Brent. So we got a call for a Bronco that is broke down on the Double Sammy Trail. We're gonna head up there and see if we can get him out. We're rolling in the wrecker. We got Colin here with the weather. This is the crew today. It's me and Peanut, and then we got Tom, Tom, and Caitlin in the back in the Morvair. There was nothing going on at the shop, so we asked them if they wanted to come along and do some wheeling, and they said yes. We're going four wheel drive. So we're following behind Matt. I think we're really just here for moral support. He's in the wrecker and it can do this job, but we're just having a good time. It's a beautiful day out here too. It is so. gorgeous today. A little bit wet, cloudy. It's nice. It's a good day. Okay, we made it to the shoe. I think I saw the guy on the other side, so. We're about to find out. Yeah, there was a bunch of people there a couple weeks ago. Woo! How's it going? Up on the hill. Okay. <laughs> just, just short of the chute. Yeah. Where is that at right there? I'm not sure what's wrong with it. I think the customer said that it just quit running. So. We're gonna have to hook up to this thing and just pull it on out of here. You enjoying that? What's he thinking? I don't know, that's what I was just wanting to ask him. So. What are you thinking, Matt? I'm thinking about rolling him back. Rolling, rolling him back, back and grabbing the front. Him. And then hooking it and just, just flat towing out of here. Oh. Oh, really? Yeah, there's no reason to pick it up unless there's something else wrong with it. Nope, nope, she rolls fine. We, I was drug into this position. I'll get her the brakes. Pretty good. Okay. That's good enough right there. Move the wheel over. Like I said though, I would love to find neutral here. I think you got it. Front bumper attached pretty good. Yeah, directly to the front. And these have got the uh, plates behind them. Should be. If they'll stay. Yeah. And uh, it has been taking a beating all week, so. So a little, a little more time. Nice and gentle. <laughs> so are you just gonna go straight up this, or are you gonna go around? Something. I don't know. Something. I actually place the hooks upward so they don't fall off. Yeah. Okay. Little ball bearings. Tom, you want to jump in that? Sure. So, which way should I go? Straight up and over. Straight up? Yes. It ain't gonna climb that today. <laughs> you don't think it'll go up that? No. Not today. On a nice warm day with clean tires and clean rocks. You ready, Tom? I think so. I hope this wasn't the last guy that tried to help. No, he's the last guy that was brave enough to ride with me. Oh yeah? <laughs> well, I'm glad I'm driving. <laughs> I'm gonna double that up. Yeah, we're gonna try this. And that might even be too long. Should have brought Rory's rope. Yeah. What were we thinking? Okay.
Other way. There you go. like that. This, gotta climb, huh? this is, I can't believe how, it, is it heavy? You're out of it. He doesn't got any power steering. He's having a hard time turning it. What if you backed him up and then you went down there? Yeah, listen to that. Yeah, because it's, there's no way you can be able drop to. I can drop off right here. Yeah, okay. I like that idea. Good idea, man. I'm giving that one to you. Instead of trying to come up here, because if you look at that, that is a terrible angle, and without him being able to steer, that's not going to go well. We're going to back down and have Matt drop off right here, so we'll take the Bronco down the regular trail. Hold the brakes for a second. We should just pick this thing up. I think it'd be easier. I know. I'm gonna come up. Okay, let's turn these wheels. All right, all right. All the way this way. Off the brake. You gotta be off the brake. I'm off the brake. Okay. Okay, you wanna grab that other side? Is it just not? Here we go. That's as far as I can go. Uh, you want to un unlock that hub? Turn okay, it turn it as hard as you can while we're doing this. It's going. Look at that teamwork. Unbelievable. <laughs> okay, as I start to inch you forward, well, hold on. just keep giving her the sauce. Is it working? It's coming. Pulling that rear end around that tire. It's coming, it's coming. Ooh, there it goes. Do I need to hold this line? Oh, there you go. <laughs> turn the other way. Okay, turn this way, Tom. Okay, keep going and he'll turn. Turn it, turn it. Turn it! Keep going! All you got! Slow, 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 Brent! Oh. You're on the rope! <laughs> there are no brakes? All the brakes I had! Alright, let's hook up to this thing. Today's the first time we've been on that bumper today. Yeah. You want to try and roll forward a little bit, get off this, and then pick me up? Like, what no, you I got, I'm got. i going to have to pull the rope out from underneath you right here. Yeah. Just Watch out, Peanut. Stand on the brakes. I'm standing on the brakes with all I got. That looked like a hard hit. How's your neck feeling? I'm all right. It was a hard hit. I was standing on him. I think I slid in. Okay, it's out. Okay, Tom, as you come up, you gotta turn driver. No, no, Dad, stop, stop, stop. Hold on. I'm worried you're gonna rip that suspension out. His wheels are all the way locked. Okay. All right, we're gonna have to pick this up. It doesn't have the capability to be flat-toed. We're just gonna pick it up. How much do you trust this front bumper? 
More than brakes and steering? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Because I could just grab it right there and right there. I have an appointment in 20 minutes that I cannot miss. Something's locked. Maybe the column? It feels like the column's locked up. Like I'm, I'm hitting a hard stop. What do you got to do on it? Pry bar? Yeah, just loosen it up. The, the locks in the column are... Okay, turn this way. I want the wheel straight. Right there? Yeah, right there. Okay, yeah. I'll just hold them. Okay, this is going to get a little spicy coming off of here. Okay, take it real easy. Keep going. Turn right. Okay, right there. You. Thanks for spotting, Kaylin. I got you. That's crazy. That was nerve wracking. Holy smokes. I've got a five o'clock appointment that I can't miss. So I'm gonna take this down to the tunnel. I'm gonna jump the fence. Jamie will be waiting for me in her rental chariot. I'm gonna leave these guys to finish the job. Do you remember last time when you left us to do a job? Okay. Yeah, you better not have the tracks come off on this. <laughs> All right, well, this is my stop. Don't worry, Tom, you're in good hands. Is Matt taking off? Yes. All right, Colin. Bye. <laughs> uh, you're good from here, loading it on? Yeah, okay. I've loaded it dead before, so. <laughs> well, keep it running, it's a cool old truck, man. Yeah. yeah let's get you a t-shirt. All there right. There you go. Nice, that looks good. <laughs> Hey, thank you, we really appreciate you. Oh. Compared to the mountain bike you were on in like 1993, it's a little bit different. Yeah, that one would have been a huffy. You could probably keep it in the middle and just pedal, because you don't... I got power. You got power. Um, Low power. And we, got, and we got you a helmet and some shoes. So why okay. don't we put those on and we'll show you how to use a bike. Awesome. Yeah. I'm looking at you guys and I'm feeling a little 
overdressed for the occasion. Yeah, honestly, this is gonna be the most important thing, your helmet. And we got shoes. I mean, you could ride in cowboy boots, but this is gonna probably, this is gonna grip the pedals a little bit better. Let's do this. All right, we're taking off on this trail. Where are you, Seth? You're gonna know the oh, no! Gonna yeah! <laughs> I did it! So these guys are hardcore. They're trying to do me in. They set up a little competition where they're driving upside down for a minute, right there. I'm gonna watch and see how they do it. There's no one that loves a bad idea more than I do, but I do wanna see this a couple times before I commit. Oh my goodness. Colin, you gonna do it? Oh, I'm gonna do it. I gotta represent for more. <laughs> yeah, I, I think I'm out. I got fragile bones. Okay, here goes Carter. <laughs> Wait a second. Got this. Oh. Nice. Oh, that was deeper than I was thinking. Yeah, that, that's... Okay, Carter, you got this? Nice. So Tom's going to try the e-bike out here. I'm on his whip right now. Do you like it? It's fun, but it's too much power, Matt. This is for you. Every time I pedal it, it just wants to take off. Nice. Now that's not a real obstacle, but it's kind of my level of obstacle. You've got bike skills. I like this bike. Seth here is taking me on a red diamond. Yeah. That's, that's what we're on. Yeah, You've been riding it. You've been cleaning it. Oh, really? It, it shouldn't be rated a red diamond, but it's a red diamond. You did a red diamond. Well, there's an obstacle up here. I just watched somebody walk up it, and he says we're going to try to ride up it. And then I'm nervous because everybody's like, I want to watch this guy right here ride up it. I've got confidence in you, I think. But don't don't try it if you don't feel comfortable. Never feel pressured. Oh, that's like a double dog dare. That is one step beyond a double dog dare, what you just said. Everybody's walking up it and they're gonna they're having me ride up it. Look at that. They're walking up it. Alright, so got a couple of bad influences here. Are you bad influences or bad influencers? Whatever. These guys are bad. <laughs> <laughs> they're making me do bad things but i'm having a ball so i'm not gonna complain you'll never hear that i'd also like you to know i did that in one cut all right so it turns out my suspension was a little bit soft and seth assures me it's not because i'm fat he says it's because i'm riding at a higher performance level so he had to pump the shocks up for the higher performance i'm just gonna go with that yeah we'll go with that All good? Oh. I'm okay. This is my life. This is what I do. Water Took an right. optional line <laughs> and ended up landing there. Hey, it worked great till it was. It was a soft somersault. Yeah. You landed in a bunch of cactuses, actually. Yeah. Yeah, you did. Right there. Seth, thank you so much for this opportunity. Like, when we invited you out here, you're like, hey, I want to stick around and do some mountain biking. Could you be interested in that? I'm like, heck yes, I would. And here we are. This was just an incredible day. Now we're gonna get some food, right? We're gonna get some food. It's It's been a pleasure for me too. This is why we mountain bike. We go out and we have fun. Uh, people get different things out of it. They get the fitness out of it, the views, the exploring. This is this is why I do it. The, you know, goading each other and challenging and having fun. It was, it was an amazing amount of fun. And then just thank you so much. Um, this, this bike is gonna make it so that I have to get out there with my kids. I really enjoy spending time with my kids. They love mountain biking and 
Just make it so I can do it. Got no excuses now. Got no excuses. Okay, we're gonna get some lunch. That was a lot of fun. We spent the full day out there doing all kinds of trails. We don't do a lot of mountain biking stuff on this channel. Seth does a ton on his channel. If you wanna see me shred the trails on Gooseberry, check this channel out right here. Now, back to the thing we're doing. What are you guys doing? Putting on a heat shield. So my dad isn't here with us, but thanks for watching. Dad, you're really shredding right now. I'm very impressed, actually. You're, you're shredding. I live with these kids and they don't even know what I can do.